broke out there. Very so On purpose, as you yeah. know, uh, I had this uh, <coughs> invitation from the Franco Hellenic uh, Chamber of Commerce, but uh, it's of course an interesting time, and we're watching that. We, we don't have to intervene in any vote, but you know that the Commission and the European Union, of course, welcomes the fact that there is an agreement on the name Macedonia for historical strategic uh, reasons. And uh, I'm not commenting tonight's vote, but the uh, next vote. But the next time when you will be here, you will be obliged to say North Macedonia, not Macedonia. Yeah, this is right. <laughs> I said the name. This is the, the most important for us. I was us. not saying the name. Yeah. Okay. The, the agreement you found. I think that it's an historical step. And I'm very confident that uh, the next days the Greek Parliament uh, will secure the stability of, uh, of the country because we are in a very significant time. We are in the path of uh, growth and st political stability is uh, very significant as well. And uh, I'm very optimistic about the future because uh, we overcome the Difficulties, and now we have uh, uh, we have uh, possibility to have more growth rates in the future, to decrease more unemployment, which is the most important for me, and then to try to have uh, more uh, investments uh, to manage to have more investments in Greece in the next time, because this is uh, as well significant in order to keep uh, these uh, uh, growth rates. So I'm confident that uh, we will overcome the political difficulties as we uh, manage to overcome the financial difficulties in, in the past. You know, my, my visit is mostly about the economy. I will uh, see uh, leaders from the business and from the banking sector. And my message is, uh, of course, positive because we see that now Greece is moving as a normal member of the Eurozone. We have welcomed the uh, results uh, from the fiscal side and the surplus you are capable to raise. We are, of course, uh, welcoming reforms and uh, we think this should lead to uh, the disbursement of the first tranche of the post-programme uh, agreement, uh, these ANFA and SNP profits. Uh, I will meet a few of your ministers to, to work on the way to get there. And um, of course, this creates a climate where Greece is capable of creating growth, getting back to jobs, also delivering social measures for the Greek people who have suffered so much during the crisis. And we hope to make it with you, the Greek government and the Greek people, a full success story because uh, uh, the Greeks deserve it, obviously. They need it, they want it, they deserve it. It is true.